because of the sunnies. But anyways, Isaac was sadly eaten by a cake or something because he disappeared when he was making cake. This week we are making banana bread in the future, but it's really bad because I don't have Isaac to film for me or edit for me. So this is what you're stuck with. Let's put on our professional glasses. Hold on, I've got a way cooler way of doing this. They're on now. The first thing you need to do is obviously get your ingredients, but after, before you do that, you need to make the dough or the mixture. I'm gonna call it the mixture because there's multiple mixtures you need to make. So now I get to go to Pass Lucy. Hello. We got some parts are just pretty boring, so if it gets too boring, just tell um, me to never do this again. And if Isaac never comes back, then I guess it's the end of the season show. Brown sugar. We got our bananas. This one I accidentally already opened because I was flinging it around. Don't do that, kids. Guys, wait, hold on. I'm gonna go dangerous. Wait, what if? Okay. I'm starting to turn a little bit into Isaac's hair. But listen, what if? What if I put chocolate chips in the banana bread? Got a lot of flour. Okay. <gasps> oh no! Well, we got two cups of flour. No. Come off of my phone. No. Look at that. It's not coming off. I, I can't believe it. The brew? No way. In my hand. We're doing my dad's homemade flour. That's that's one cup of this stuff. This stuff is like out of bounds, man. Okay, that's I guess one teaspoon. If I make this wrong, I might oh. two teaspoons. Okay, you can't even see my face, so I'm like one of those adults in Charlie Brown. Yep. A wah wah. Now we gotta get a bowl. Peeled by banana. And then mash them. Nanners. Yeah, this is very hard to do without like a camera person. Like I just look so good because he has me to film, and I'm such a great filmer, as y'all know because you watch these. Which, by the way, why do you watch them? Just wondering. I kind of suck at filming, but and I'm very boring. Morning headphone users, you gotta have two beaten eggs. Now we're gonna go get our mixer mixer. I have the KitchenAid with me today to serve a little bit of a purpose, I guess. <gasps> no! Sorry. The bananas went, I mean the thing went in the bananas. It's so hard to film. Okay. So we're gonna get a little bit of a side view. Gotta plug this in. Heat the oven to 350 degrees. That's probably a good thing to know. If you want bread pan, for each loaf we're gonna make, we're gonna make two loaves. Um, actually I don't know how high to fill it up, but we'll figure that out later. Okay, you need three fourths of a cup of, um, actually wait, you need Six fourths, so like, I don't, um, I don't know how much six fourths. It's not two. It's a cup and a half, so like one cup. So you just need three scoops, but you need three fourths if you're just making one recipe. Um. together the brown sugar and the butter which I don't have but I don't know how much butter we need so the butter is just sticking to my butter I forgot to put in double recipe with the butter and with the eggs I don't have enough eggs so I need you to bring me one egg Okay. when do you need it 
like sooner rather than later. So now I'm having my mom bring me some an egg. Also, I didn't put enough butter in, so I had to put in margarine because we didn't have any more butter at that either. So just always be prepared, okay, guys? It just said stop when well, well we mix it mixed but I'm putting the chocolate chip right in here. Chocolate! I don't know. I'm just gonna put all of them. Okay, so got all the bananas and all the eggs in there and it looks kind of weird. Kind of liquidy. I don't know if it's supposed to be, but whatever. We're going for it. But I mean, we're going with it. Now that we're done with all the other the mixtures, then we need to mix the, all the mixtures together in the same bowl. Let's go look at that big boy mixture. Oh, all those at the bottom. Yep, yum. Yum. Yum, 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 yum. I don't know if I'm supposed to be like... It's a stir just for the... Um, the mixing of it, not for I mean, I, I don't know why it says stir, but it said stir for something. Pan. Doing good. Bam. How much do I fill it up, Dad? Are you asking me a question? Yeah. Um, okay. How did you know I just did this? Just split it in half. Okay. I didn't mix this very well, guys. Oh well. Okay, so, I got all of those done, done. And my oven has been preheating for many hours. Just kidding. Next, we're going to be doing the last process. Not the last process. Bake. Yeah. Ha. Then this one might burn a little bit. It looks less pretty, but. Now we're just gonna let it bake. We're gonna set a timer for an hour. Oh no, don't timer. There we go. One hour. Now we get to clean up. Dad's filming this for me. I'm taking Oh my god. I just burnt myself. Um, okay. Banana bread has some chocolate chicken. We will taste test it in a minute. You want to poke it right down the center with a toothpick. And if it comes out mostly clean, then it should be done. But banana bread, most of the time. Banana bread, most of the time. A little bit chewy so you don't want it to be too cooked right um so we got a nice little banana bread we're gonna wait for it to cool off um and then we'll all see what it tastes like later okay now is the last process where we we feast now feasting is the most important but we didn't get any on camera i don't think maybe we did i don't know but you have to feast in order for these to matter. Because if you don't feast, then it will rot. And you probably don't want that to happen. It's ready. So, I have this beautiful loaf here. So this is what it looks like. I'm hoping that this <laughs> tastes good. This is just the first loaf that I made. So the other one's over there. But seems pretty good. Thank That's you. it. Back to Future Lucy. Uh, let's go back to me in the chair. Let's go. Well, that was weird. <laughs> the door. 